Hey guys, Brian here from Liquid Concepts. So uh, today we're gonna be doing something a little bit special, uh, a little bit more custom, and thought you guys would like to see a video on it. And so today we're actually gonna be doing a mouse pad. So this is for uh, a custom mouse pad for a customer of ours. Uh, apparently he loves World of Tanks, and so we're going to give him a World of Tanks custom mouse pad. So. Um, what we've got here is we've got a 3D printed mouse pad. Uh, we've already went through and sanded it all down, smoothed it all out, got everything ready to go, and based it in a white base coat. So now all we've got to do is, is take this, we're going to lay this down in the water, dip it, and then you're going to have a custom one-off mouse pad with, of course, World of Tanks and the logo all in it just like this. So again, this is our custom film uh, that we print in-house. So. Let's go ahead and get started with this. We're gonna pull this off like that. Set that just like that right there so we can throw this away. And then we'll take this and set it right down on the water. All right, so now that we've got that there, we wanna to try to contain this as much as we can just to kind of keep it from stretching any at all because the custom film it's, it's a lot better if you can contain it as close together as you can. So uh, what we've got is, is we've got 60 seconds on the clock. We're gonna let it sit on the water for 60 seconds and then we're gonna take our part and dip it. Now again, with this right here, we actually have World of Tanks and the logo on there. So we gotta try to center that as best we can. And then once we do that, then we're gonna actually come back. It's gonna be really cool. We're actually going to distress it, make it look like it's literally been through the battlefield with the World of Tanks in the actual gameplay. So it's gonna be really cool, so definitely stay tuned for that. But let me go grab some gloves and we'll get started. So we got about 60 seconds on the clock. It's sitting at about 82 degrees right now. In between 80 to 90 is pretty much right where you wanna be. And then so 60 seconds, we've got it right there. And we're gonna go ahead and spray it and get started. So. Gonna take this here, one pass across just like that. And then now that we've got this here, we wanna make sure that we line this up as best we can to get everything lined up just the way that it needs to be. And then just slow and steady all the way down into the water. Just like so. And so now, Whenever we pull it back out, we have our world of tanks along with the logo and all the way around. Looks like we got really good coverage, so everything came out really good. So customer's gonna love this. We're gonna rinse it, uh, do a little bit of distressing on it, and then come back in, clear coat it, and they're absolutely going to love it. It's gonna look really awesome, so stay tuned. So everything came out awesome with the World of Tanks. Uh, we went ahead, we did a lot of the distressing on it. The, uh, the dip came out really good. We did a few little touch-ups here and there and customer definitely loved it. Of course, we threw on there the flat clear that we have and it looked amazing. It looked like it had been drugged through the dirt, through World War I, World War II, and everything in between. And of course, it's as smooth as possible. So you get the best of both worlds. It looks like it's worn like crazy, but it feels practically brand new. So I hope you guys really enjoyed that video. Uh, I know we always do all the time. And so if you have any questions or comments, definitely leave them below. We'd love to hear from you. And um, if you have anything that you'd like to see next time on any of our videos, definitely give us a shout out and also if you haven't already subscribe we'd love to have you subscribe for our weekly tips and tricks and um, just uh, we love doing this stuff so if you got anything you'd like to see definitely let us know so till next time I'm Brian from life from that <laughs> we'll try this again so till next time I'm Brian from liquid concepts and we're making hydrographics great again see you guys next time